what's up and welcome back to Wonder Boy. Where today I'm going to be taking a look at the Lego Toy Story 4 sets. Uh, I think I think some of them aren't for Toy Story set. I think only this one, but I am not 100% sure. Or uh, anyways, unfortunately they are junior sets because that went so well with the Incredibles last time. I'm I'm really sad because I really wanted to see Toy Story sets that weren't junior. I mean, I know I w probably wasn't the only one worried that Toy Story 4 sets, if they did come out, were going to be Junior. Oh, well, I guess it could be it could be worse. We couldn't have Toy Story 4 sets, but I think some people would just prefer that. Anyways, the first set we have is the only set I really like and will probably buy. It's Woody's RV. RV, I, I think that's what it's called. RV, yeah, uh, uh, no matter. Anyway, sure, the set isn't as good as the 2010 version. The army, f they use, um, like the mini fig, the mini figs, micro figs that go as army soldiers, which I'm kind of disappointed because we had such cool figs in 2010 and I really want to get my hands on one of those. Oh well, uh, they're. The cones and boxes are okay, nothing special, but they do add flair to the set. The um, the remote control car is pretty great. I know it has a name, but right now I cannot think of it. And Woody looks great. Sure, the set isn't anywhere near as good as any of the 2010 sets, that's, but for $10, I'm taking it, to be honest. It's probably the only good set. Next up, we have the camping trip for $35, which I think is a little overpriced, but it's junior, so whatever. The Jesse minifig looks great. Forky looks great! That's right, we got a Forky fig! Um, T-Rex looks okay. A, which they're actually using the same piece they used in 2010, huh? And the alien looks fine. And the builds are okay, but nothing special. Not worth the $35, in my opinion. Next up, we have the fairground. There's um Buzz. Uh, there's the um like chicken. There's the bunny, and there's Woody. Sure, there is some fun stuff. Like I do like the carts. Uh, the the um Star Adventure looks really fun. The op octopus. There we go. It's great, and the ice cream bar looks great. But fifty bucks? Heck no! I thought this was gonna be forty bucks, and I still thought that was overpriced. So moving on, next up we have the roller coaster for twenty bucks. This set is nothing special. It's like ninety six pieces or eighty six pieces, but it does have roller coaster piece. So I'm gonna go. I'm gonna let it slide. All right, but there's nothing special about this set. Nothing feels good. I might buy it for the um, Buzz Fig because you know, Toy Story fan. They're the best movies ever. Anyways, that's probably gonna just be it. I'm I'm still pretty disappointed in most of these sets, so I'm just gonna go be sad in different corner, you know. But don't click away from this video yet. Do you like Legos? Do you like free stuff? Well, I got a surprise for you. We're doing a giveaway, and by we, I mean me, because I'm the only person in driving this channel. I know. Anyways, the giveaway is going to be about the Lego Movie 2 Emmett's Peace Offering Polybag, which is a great polybag, and go check out, out my um, video on it. Um, link, 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 sh um, link should be in the description below. Anyways, all you have to do is go to the description below, and the link will be there. Don't worry, I will separate the links and tell you which one is which. It, and then after you do what the link tells you to do, which is going to be put your email, all you got to do is watch watch a video, or comment on a video, or like a video, or do all three, and you have a chance of getting into the, the um, of winning the poly bag. There we go. And you can do it daily. Now, if you're a winner, then then subscribe for even a better chance to win. And if you don't want to enter contest because you already have that poly bag, then make sure to subscribe. By the way, uh, I will only be able to ship if you're in the U.S. because I'm just a kid and I do not have 350 bucks to send to to send something to Africa or was it Australia? Whatever, 350 bucks is way off my limit. 
Anyways, I hope to see y'all the next time. Good.